I'm going to walk you through five ways to check if you've been hacked on your iPhone. Now, if you suspect a variety of different ways that you might be hacked, I'm going to walk you through all these different ways, how to get it fixed, how to make sure your iPhone is secure, and whether it's been hacked or not been hacked. Now, the very first thing, let's open this up, is that you might have gone to Safari or Google Chrome and you see a pop-up that looks like this. It says your iPhone has been hacked. It might say various things like you have to close this or you have to hit the open button for you to you know, subscribe to something to unhack your phone. In most instances, these pop-ups in Safari are a scam. They're not actually hacked your phone but just in case that potentially there's an issue with your Safari or Google Chrome, let's hop out of here and open up our settings. And then we're gonna scroll down until we get to Safari here. I'm gonna tap on Safari. And then you can see I can scroll down here and you wanna make sure prevent cross-site tracking is turned on. Hide IP address is turned on, so it says from trackers here. And then fraudulent website warning is turned on like I have. So turn on all of those if you haven't turned them on yet. And then just tap clear history and website data. So I'm gonna, it'll close all my tabs and clear all of the cache, all of the data there that resets Safari. You can do the same steps on Google Chrome if you're getting this pop-up as well and this helps to secure that web browser. So now that you've done that, the other indication that your phone might be hacked is if you're seeing something that looks like this, the very top right. So if you're seeing these two dots, say a green dot or an orange dot, that's an indication that either your camera is on or your microphone is on. So if you're not using an app like FaceTime or Zoom or something like that, then that's a strong indication that potentially something bad is going on. So we'll go into our settings again and go back. And then from here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna scroll down until we find camera here. So we can tap on camera and in here, no, that's not it. We wanna go to privacy and security right here, and then go to camera. So this is where it allows any given apps to use your camera and your microphone. So if you see those two dots at the very top right, just start clicking these off and see which one turns off that light and that'll give you an indication maybe one of these apps that you have on your phone is hacked. So go through this list and turn off the camera for any of these, the permission to use the camera. And if you see that light all of a sudden turn off, that's a good indication that you should go to that app and delete that app because it might have been hacked. So go through those different steps. The next thing that we'll do is if you head into your calendar and you're getting these weird notifications, you're getting pop-ups that say like you've been invited to random giveaways or inappropriate things or just sketchy things that you haven't subscribed to on your calendar, there's a chance that somebody got into your calendar and a hack or um, a little bug got into your calendar. That's a common way that people will try to hack your iPhone. So go on here and if you see anything sketchy on this list, I'm gonna show you how to delete it. So let's go out of here and open up our settings again and we will go back. Now we will scroll down until we find calendar right here. And then we'll tap on accounts. Now these are all of the accounts that might be syncing up their calendar with your phone. So if anything on here looks sketchy, you can just go to that and you can either tap delete account or you can adjust it so that it's turned off. You can just toggle off that mail and the at, uh, the calendar option and all that stuff. So that doesn't use your calendar. So that's another different way. The fourth way that we'll walk through is, let's go back in here. If you see these sign-in requests 
where it says your Apple ID is being used to sign into a different device nearby. This is a good indication that somebody is trying to break into your Apple account or your iPhone. So if you see something like this and this was not you, then what we'll do is we'll head into settings again and let's go back and scroll to the very top. Now what we'll do is tap on our name and then tap on password and security right there. Once we're in here, you'll want to make sure that two-factor two authentication is turned on here. So make sure you've turned that on. You can potentially change your password at the very top. If you suspect somebody is trying to break into your account, it's a good idea to just change your password so that even if they for some reason did guess or know your password, they won't have it anymore. And then the fifth way that you can make sure that your phone is not hacked is to go back here and scroll to the very bottom and you can see the various devices here at the bottom. Make sure that you recognize all of these devices. If there's a random computer or phone or tablet on here, just tap on it and then it will give you at the, well, this, this is my phone. So tap on a different one and then just tap remove account at the very bottom there. So remove that from access to your iCloud account and that will help to secure it as well. Hope this helps. Thanks for your time today and I'll see you on the next one.